Y'all, I am loving that bubbly, sparkling water in this cup. It's good. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I am so excited because I am at Sam's Club for the very first time. And I am going to go in, see what we can get. I'm really not sure what I'm going to get. I'm just going to look around, I think. I know I need paper products. I was so excited because I got half off, so I got my membership for $25 for the first year. So let's head inside. Let's see what we get. So I'm just going to go ahead and let you guys know I'm going to have to do a voiceover in the store because this store's music was loud. But I love these Valentine suckers for $10.98. I'm going to pick this up to give my kindergartners on Valentine's Day. And look at this charcuterie board. I would love to do a charcuterie board video, and this is a clearance price. Let me know down below. Do you think I should do a charcuterie board video? I would love to do that. I also saw this Rubbermaid take-alongs container here. It had 64 pieces, and I love the big tote that it's in. This was a $15.98. That is a great deal. And I honestly did not know that Sam's Club carried things like freezers. But this crock pot has intrigued me because I need a new crock pot. I don't know if this is a good deal, but I do need a new crock pot. So I may come back and get this one. This is where my jaw dropped when I was looking at the household items. This is a great deal on this Dawn dish detergent and you can get it for $9.88. What? So I'm definitely going to grab this. 25 pounds of flour. $11.88? No, $11.48? I really like this picnic pack of condiments here for $9.86. And this looked like a pretty good deal too. This was pasta. You got six boxes for $8.98. So, and it was a variety pack. So that was interesting too. But I love these Valentine kits. This is precious and my kiddos would love this if they were still young, but they're not. This is a create your own Valentine's mailbox. They have the unicorn and the dinosaur. This was so precious and it has everything you need inside. I love that. And here we go. Let's head home. Okay, y'all. So, <clears throat> my thoughts on Sam's Club. One thing that I want to say is, wow. I mean, wow. There were some really good deals in there, but you have to kind of think for a minute. And I'm going to be honest. It was my first time in there, and I was kind of overwhelmed. Like, not in a bad way. It wasn't bad. It was like, wow, there's so much to look at. So, <laughs> there was so much to look at. I was really excited. I really liked a lot of the things that I saw. I went in with the thought process of just kind of look around, get a feel for it. And I knew there were a few like household items that I needed. So that's what I went in with. So that's what I kind of stuck with. I did grab a few extra things that wasn't already in my mental list. So I will show you guys that when we get home. But I'm excited to kind of play around here and see what all Sam's Club has to offer and go when I can kind of think. <laughs> okay, so I am back from Sam's Club for the first time. Like I said, I was very impressed. Like there was so much to look at. And so I, I think I'm just going to have to kind of take it in batches <laughs> and just think about um, each item and do some more research. But I did get a couple of things that I did need and those were some household items. Let me just turn you around. Let me show you what I got. So here is my tiny Sam's Club haul. I say tiny because it's not many items, but I feel like I got a lot. So let's start here. I was interested to see the toilet paper situation. So I got this big thing of toilet tissue here. There's like 45 rolls. That was like $22 or something like that. Then I got some trash bags. I was out of trash There's bags. There's 200 of them. I got these for $19. So that was a pretty good deal. I got this big 
pack of paper plates. These plates, there's 300 and these were $22. I got some Dawn dish detergent that I thought was a pretty good deal. This Dawn dish detergent is 90 ounces. It rang up $11.88, but I had a $2 um, instant savings come off at the register. So $9.88, that's a pretty good deal. I did get this four pack of Dial soaps. This hand soap here rang up at $10.78, but I got another $2 instant savings off of that. So that was $8.78. I only got two food items. I saw this Kinder's and this is a pretty big, this is a big container of um, seasoning. I mean, you can see it's as tall as the soap. So I've seen lots of people using this Kinder seasoning and I can't find it or haven't seen it. So I grabbed this one, the cracked pepper and Parmesan. Excited to try that. That was a really good deal. Um, I felt like for that item. Just to show you how big this container is, this is a normal like seasoning. This is like garlic powder. And this is the Kinder's. So it's nine ounces where your normal one that you would get in the, the grocery store, this is, 3.12 ounces. So this Kinder seasoning was $6.98. I think it, I think I read a different price in the store, but this was $6.98. So I'm excited to try this on some recipes. I think it might be good on some chicken too. And then I saw this. This was um on sale. So these were just some little packs of snack packs that you could put in lunch. And these were seven dollars and 98 cents it's 18 little packs of little snack packs let's see the ghostly ranch is ghost pepper almonds ranch cheese balls cashews and pretzel twist and then the baja twist mix is taco seasoned cashews corn nuggets almonds and dried pineapple so i thought that would be something good to try for just seven dollars and 98 cents and each pack is only like 120 calories. So that'll be easy to put into lunches. And then this item, this was cute. These are like Valentine's. It's got the little to and from little sucker kit. There's 24. I thought this would be good for my class. So I'm gonna give these to my kiddos for Valentine's day. And this was only $11. So I got two of those. One for my class and one for my daughter's class. My total for all of these items was $126.67. Now, as far as my grocery total for the month goes, I'll only add in these two food items to the grocery total. The rest was just household and then this was classroom. So, I don't know, I think I did pretty good for my first time. Again, I was very excited and pleased. I saw lots of neat things there. I really want to spend more time kind of looking through the grocery items. Um, spent a lot of time through the household items. Let me know what's something that you always buy at Sam's Club, something that maybe I need to try. Give me a shout in the comments below and let me know what is it that I did not get today that I need to get? What's a good deal? What's something that's yummy? Are there different things at different times of the year that I need to be looking for? But I'm very pleased with this Sam's Club first haul of mine. So that's going to do it for this Sam's Club haul. I can't wait to go back and explore more. So if you like this video, give me a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already thought about it, and leave me that comment down below and tell me what do I need to get at Sam's Club. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye. Mm -hmm.